Hi guys, um, welcome to the short episode I'm making. I haven't, made it, I haven't made any videos for a while, but I just thought I'd make this quick one on this Canon 7D. Today I'm just going to demonstrate how to change the shutter speed and to get a really good shutter speed for like if you're an Instagram user or you're a uh, slow shutter speed user and how to change it really on this model. So I'm going to switch it on first. So as the switch button's there, I'm going to switch this on. So I just switch it on. Once I've switched it on, I'm going to put it into AV mode. So it's already at the moment on AV mode, as you can see. So once I put it on AV mode, I can now play around with the shutter speed. So if I click on this, this little Q button here, okay, so if I click on the little Q button, it will take me to the main menu. Okay, so once I'm in the main menu, I can then change uh, various things within there. So if I go back to the Q button, there's my shutter speed. So essentially all I need to do is change that. And how I would do that is I can either, I can revolve this little wheel button, wheel button here and that will allow me to change the shutter speed. So if I just do that, I can change the shutter speed. So I can take it one forward slash 20th of a second, 15th of a second, 8th of a second, and I can take it back forth all the way around. So if I take it 400, you can see it's dead quick. And if I turn it the other way, so if I again click on this Q button here, and turn it the other way, and I take it to one, minus 1.3 seconds and take a picture this time, move my camera around. I should get a little bit of motion blur in the picture and you can see it's, it's overexposed, uh, the picture. So I haven't got a card in here, but I'm just demonstrating this. So if I do that again, so if I, so if I click on the Q button, there's my shutter speed. And if I take a picture, move it around, you can clearly see that it's overexposed. Okay, so shutter speed is mainly for using within low light, um, you know, you want to increase the shutter speed so you got more light coming through to the aperture, so therefore your pictures will be better exposed. But you need to control it via the shutter speed and the aperture in order to get the right consistency. Um, you know, obviously ISO plays a factor as well in low light, so that's something you need to think about. But to summarize, basically, you just put your camera on, to put it into AV mode, so it's at the moment in AV mode, there you go, and then if I sort of press my uh, camera on, click on the Q button, that is my shutter speed, and to change it, all I do is revolve around this to increase and decrease my shutter speed to, to get the best exposure for the, for the image. Um, any questions about shutter speed, please do give me a shout. So if you want to do low shutter speed, like light drawings and all that sort of stuff, really you want to take this number down by revolving this, um, you know, to get that nice exposure. You might need to sort of play around with your ISO as well and your, uh, your aperture ratio uh, to get the right noise level down to get the nice image that you want. Okay, this is obviously this camera is not touch screen, so I'm not sort of using the touch screen features on here. Um, because they don't exist basically. Um, however, you know, it, it does, it, you know, it is quite useful in terms of your, your shutter speed. You know, like I've got it on live mood, live view here as well. So as you can clearly see in my live view, um, I've got it in f f camera mode. Here's my shutter speed. So I can also change it by the wheel up here as well. So there's a wheel, there's a wheel here. And I can move this in and out. And I can also use this as well. When I do that, you can see, you can see the number will change as you can see that. Okay, if I bring it a bit closer, maybe there you go. So the number changes, and then you know the more the more seconds I uh, seconds I give it, the more ex in in focus it is. The less I give it, so if I take it down, you can see my screen starts to get out of fo like it becomes white because there's too much light going through to the sensor. So you know, you essentially what it is the aperture the shutter is a gate and you are controlling the amount of light that goes to the sensor, okay? So, it's simple as that, okay? So if you like a, a viewpoint and like to see a visual, then obviously you can see via this, but obviously if you want to see in your quick time view, which is this one here, then you can see in your quick time view, and it will show you uh, um, all the dials, etc., to show you what the views are. Okay, summarize, I've just shown you shutter speed. Perfect for slow shutter speed if you are thinking about taking those pictures in low light and you want to create low drawings, light drawings, shall I say, sorry. Any questions, please post and I will be happy to respond to any questions you may have. Thank you for watching, guys. See you next time.